Here is the way that Blackboard provides us to insert images in our homepage announcements. So let's go to a new announcement, create an announcement, and we'll put in the title. And then from there, we're going to copy and paste an announcement from a Word document and insert it into our announcement area. To begin putting in the image, put one on the right first, click somewhere in the middle of the top line, then click on the images icon and browse your computer for the image you wish to insert. Now that it's in, be sure to give the image a name. Blackboard appreciates that very much. And then we click on Appearance. Notice that there is this preview box on the right and watch what happens as we select first right. Notice the image moved over to the right. Those dimensions are a little large. Let's take a guess at what they should be. As long as constraint proportions is on, we can type in the width and click in the height box and it will adjust automatically. For vertical space, I don't put in anything. Let's try 5 for the horizontal space. Watch how it changes up in the preview window when I change the horizontal space. 3, 2, notice how the text wraps differently. Border I don't usually use, so let's click on Insert. You notice the image is aligned to the top right there. Now to resize the image, right click on it and simply choose one of the sizing tools, hold down Shift and you can resize the image and notice how the text wrapping varies according to the image size. I'm thinking maybe we need a little bit more horizontal space there. The text a little close. Let's go to Appearance. Let's put in more horizontal space. Let's see if that looks a little any better. Okay, let's go ahead and put one down on the left. On the left, we click on the left side margin on the approximate row. We want the image. And then we go and fetch the image. Here's Nancy Duarte. Be sure to give an image description. Our Blackboard will nag you. Click on Appearance. Notice the image is on the left in our preview window. We set alignment to the left. And again, I don't usually put in much vertical space. For horizontal space, Let's start with 5 and see how that looks. Okay, we're going to have to resize Nancy. She won't mind. Right click to select the image and simply grab one of the resizing corners and bring the image down to whatever size you want or their work. Okay, let's give a little more space horizontally. Right now we've got five pixels. Let's put it eight. I wish this part in Blackboard was more consistent. You just have to play around with it. Sometimes five looks like enough space between the image and text. Sometimes eight. So anyhow, there's our announcement with two embedded images. Good luck with yours and let me know however I can help.